in your brand story. Because it's easy to be, you know, a fake version because the internet is just littered with fake people. Instagram is filled with it. You know, you've got people who are just puffing their chests, who are pretending that they're all driving around Lamborghinis, living in mansions and have beautiful, beautiful, you know, model wives or partners. But you and I know that's wrong. And you might think if you're doing something like that, that you are, you know, pulling the wool over our eyes. But we can spot a fake. We can sense a fake. And the more you kind of come across as a fake person, there's going to be a disconnect between you and your followers and your customers. So what you need to do is you need to flip it over. You need to be honest, sometimes brutally honest about yourself. Sometimes, you know, mentioning things maybe to the people that you probably haven't said to family and friends. And the more honest you are, the more you are going to come across in the video. Now, you know yourself, even going through social media, has there ever been a video where you just were stopped in your tracks and it was such a raw video? Maybe somebody was crying. Maybe somebody was, you know, all happy. Or, But you could tell coming across through the video or the content that you were reading that that person was an absolute genuine person. And they were just speaking to you just honestly and off the cuff. And you could have watched maybe a hundred videos that day. But that video stood out to you because it was just raw. It was just honest. And they felt like there was a strong connection between you and that content. And that's what you need to think about when you're building your brand story. It's just to be honest. Be authentic. You don't need to be an expert. You don't need to be beautiful. You don't need to know it all. But just be honest. You know, stop putting on these fake personas and, you know, trying to make out that you're a millionaire or a billionaire and that you're just, you know, and you're still living at home, maybe in your cellar. But... Don't be putting on those fake personalities because we can sense it. 